guys, so if you've seen my last haul video, which if you haven't, don't worry because you can go ahead and just click right here and go ahead and watch that. Anyways, so I said I had a special announcement and it's not even that big of a deal because a lot of people on YouTube have been doing this for a while now. But I've decided that I'm going to go ahead and do my own Project 10 Pan. And for those of you that don't know what that is, it's basically you're going to take 10 products and you're going to use it up completely, like in its entirety, before you can go ahead and, and purchase more um, products. And so I decided to do this because I really feel that it's necessary. Why? Just take a look for yourself. I mean, right? I should not even be allowed to buy makeup anymore. Like, I don't know. It's really a problem. And I feel like, for me, it's a really big collection already. And um, I know that a lot of that stuff in there I haven't even touched. I haven't even used. And I've forgotten about some of it because I'm buying all these makeup products all the time. And so I forget about the other stuff that I bought. And I'm not really appreciating the products that I already have. And so I'm doing this not so much as, you know so I can go ahead and buy more products once I finish up the 10 products but basically just so I can rediscover the products that I already do have and you know kind of just enjoy the collection that I already have already so I chose 10 products that I'm gonna do for my first round of Project 10 Pan I'm gonna try and you know do these in phases um, where I'm gonna do one and then take a break and then do another one just so I can use up my you know use up my products and um, it doesn't mean that I'm not gonna be doing any more videos I mean there just won't be any haul videos for a while but this may actually inspire me and motivate me to do different kinds of videos like tutorials reviews if you guys want me to do like certain looks or whatever then I'm gonna go ahead and do that so yeah, I'll share with you the 10 products that I've chosen for my first Project 10 Pan. Anyways, the first product is my Guava Passion, well, Sephora Guava Passion Body Butter. And you can see that this one's almost used up, but I can use that, you know, I can get a few more uses out of that. So that's the first one. Next would be my Urban Decay Eyeshadow Primer Potion. And when I first started getting into makeup, I used this constantly. This was always the base that I use. But then I started using paint pots. I started getting into that. And so I started using that and I kind of forgot about this. But um, this works really well, so I don't want to waste it. So I'm going to go ahead and finish that up. Next would be my Stila Multi Effect Mascara. I don't know, it's going to be tricky determining when I am completely done with this or when I can't use it anymore but um typically I would just throw this away now because I mean I've used it quite a bit and um but I really love how this mascara works I love this it's one of my favorites and so I don't really want to waste it so I thought I would put that in my project 10 pan next would be my Stila convertible color dual lip and cheek cream and this one is in Gerbera and I decided I would put this in project 10 pan because you could get you know this is very useful because it's already a cheek cream and you know you can use it on your lips so you can put it in your bag or your makeup bag and this will take care of you know your blush and your lipstick already and it's just um, I feel like I can use this up fairly quickly because it has you know two purposes Next would be my EOS lip balm. I got this, you know, not that long ago, but I'm already, I use it constantly, and so I feel like I can use that up. Another lip product would be my MAC Petting Pink Tinted Lip Conditioner. And I still have a while to go. Like, I have a lot. I mean, there's a little dip already, but you can see that there's a lot of product in there, so it's going to take me a while to finish this, but I always put something on my lips when I go to bed at night, you know, to keep my um, lips hydrated and, you know, soft, and so I should be able to use this up, hopefully. Next would be my Urban Decay Pocket Rocket Lip Gloss, and this is Kirk. Hey, and this was one of my favorite lip glosses. Um... A while ago um, but I stopped using it you can see that there's a lot of product in there too I'm gonna use that up you don't want to waste that so I'm gonna take that next would be my Sephora double compact mineral foundation and you can see that I've already hit pan 
it's exciting oops so yeah i'm gonna use this up i love this because it's so light and i like it to, to keep it natural you know fresh looking um so i really love this so i don't know if i'm gonna i'll probably repurchase this because it's kind of something it's like essential for you know when i put makeup on but we'll see because i have other um, I have like my Revlon Photo Ready Foundation and another one from Benefit, so I may not really need to buy one. But yeah, so next would be eyeshadow, one of my favorite eyeshadows, which is Hoax by MAC. And I have a while to go on this. None of my eyeshadows are close to hitting pan at all, but since I use this one a lot, um, I decided I'd put this in Project 10 Pan because I'll probably be able to finish that up. The last product would be my MAC Fix Plus and you can tell that I don't really, I still have a lot of it but um, I've started liking this recently, you know, putting it, um, I got the idea from Beat Ideas. Um, she says she uses this before she puts makeup on so I tried it and I really love it now like putting on putting it on before I put my makeup on and so and also she says putting it on before she goes to bed and it is really nice because it keeps you know it, it gives you this fresh feeling and so I'll probably be able to start using this up like within the next month or so so those are the 10 products I've chosen for project 10 pan I will be I'll try to do updates on how I'm doing um, on it. I will be trying to do more tutorials, more reviews now. Um, so yeah, I'll see you guys next time. 